Microsoft Windows was developed by Microsoft in 1985 as a GUI for MS-DOS. It is currently the world's most popular desktop operating system, taking up almost 90% of the market share. But with Microsoft's ever-increasing unpopular decisions relating to Windows, is it time to replace it altogether? Microsoft has been making many unpopular decisions in the last few years. Telemetry data has been collected from Windows 10 users with little communication about what the data is used for or simple opt-out options. Advertisements for other Microsoft products such as Edge and OneDrive have been placed within the operating system. So excluding macOS, what other option do we have? Linux is the most popular operating system on almost every other platform, being the base of Android. However, it only takes up 2% of the market share on desktop. The main reason for this is the Catch-22 problem of application and driver support. Not many are developing for Linux because not many are using it, and not many are using it because not many people are developing for it. See the problem? Wine is a compatibility layer designed to make Windows software work on other operating systems such as Linux. While it works for many popular applications, it will never be perfect as the two systems are fundamentally different. The only way Windows software could work on a different operating system would be if that system was designed similar to Windows itself. React OS is a project to create an operating system that is 100% compatible with Windows. While it is currently in alpha, it functions and looks almost identically to Windows and supports many Windows applications and drivers such as Firefox, LibreOffice and VLC Media Player, to name a few. The project is completely legal as well, as the entire project is built from scratch following clean room reverse engineering practices. This means that anyone who has worked at Microsoft or seen Windows source code is disqualified from contributing. React OS could also provide an alternative for those people who rely on Windows XP for old software, such as hospitals, banks and the military. React OS is also good for Linux users, as their code is shared with the aforementioned Wine project, which helps to run more Windows software on Linux. React OS has only had approximately 100 developers contribute to its source code since its founding. However, I believe we can do better. The project is currently focused on Windows XP compatibility. However, with support, we can push that to Windows 7. If you're a software developer or interested in becoming one, please consider contributing to the React OS project. If development isn't your thing, you could also become a tester or simply spread the word. Every part counts. With enough people working on the project, I'm confident we could provide a community-driven alternative to Windows.